Hey, hi everyone. In this video, we will learn how we can connect our rhythmic account with GoCharting. Uh, also, we know that there are many prop firms who are using rhythmic accounts. Okay. So for that, you can simply go to broker over here. Okay. Uh, and then you have to put your user ID and password. Okay. Uh, so you put your user ID here and password here, and then you use the server. Okay. So these are the servers currently we have. Okay. So you can check this. Uh, these are the uh, prop firm servers basically. And this is the data center option. Okay. And once you fill all your details, you simply uh, press on uh, I agree to terms and condition and press connect. Okay. So how you can uh, search for rhythmic broker for that click on here, go to app store and then go to USA. Okay. So then you have option of rhythmic over here. Okay. So fill your detail and click on, and then you can click on connect. So guys, uh, most of you must be knowing that there are basically two kind of props. Okay. So one kind of props, they are actually using the CFDs. Okay. So, but the other uh, kind of uh, props, which are, you know, giving you a few futures to trade. Okay. So rhythmic accounts are actually used to trade futures. Okay, so here you can see the list of those prop firms and uh, these are available prop firms right now. You can simply press on connect. Okay, so you will see that uh, it is validating. So now this rhythmic account is connected. Now uh, we have, uh, we can see that here we have the NQ futures chart. Okay, so now we will understand how we can actually trade with the help of our rhythmic account on Go charting. So once you're connected to buy and sell, you have basically three options. First option is this trade button. Okay, you can simply sell and buy over here. Second option is from these buy and sell button. So basically the same trading window appears. Now here you can see that we have this limit buy option. So you can put your limit buy price and you can also define your take profit and stop loss. And you can give based on the price offset ticks and percentage. Okay. So price means you will be putting the absolute price and offset is uh, basically you will be putting the difference. Okay. And then you can also put based on ticks and percentage. Uh, market price is simply you can it will get executed on the market price then we have stop price and we also have the stop limit price okay now after knowing this we also have this one click trading option so here what will happen the buy and sell order you can uh, place based on market order okay so this will simply place your market buy or market sell order so in this case the limit order will not go okay now we also have this plus button option. So here, if you click on this plus button, so you will see that this buy limit, sell stop and sell stop limit. And if you, you know, press this plus button above the LTP, so you will get sell limit, buy stop and buy stop limit. Okay. So now guys, uh, let me tell you uh, about the setting of the tradings and then we will see how you can trade. Basically, we'll do some practical things over here. So on this setting option, okay go to this trading setting okay so these are self uh, explanatory options we will talk about these options okay so first option is this tp spread and sl spread okay so you can define them you can predefine them say for example i keep it as 50 okay and now i close this now i again open this now now you see that the stop loss is 50 because you have already defined it okay then we have this uh, interesting feature. It's called trigger spread. So guys, what is trigger spread used for? So if you see this limit price, you have to give only one price and that you can define by this plus button on the chart. For market, we don't have to go give any option. For stop also, we have to define only one price, okay? Only one price. But for stop limit, you have to define two price. But the problem is once you are, you know, pointing at the chart with this plus button, you can only give input about one price. So there is some spread between the limit price and stop price and that, uh, you know, um, spread you can actually define in this trigger spread. Okay, so this option is for stop limit spread definition. You can also put your uh, default lots. Okay, so now in this SL spread and TP spread, we see that the setting is based on the price. So we'll put it based on the offset first of all. Okay, and put the target price spread as 100. 
And now what we'll do, we'll try to place some limit order over here. So we'll go and buy limit, okay? Now you will see that this trading panel is actually opening, okay? So this trading panel has opened and we'll go and press on the buy button. So now you will see that the order is placed and here you can also see that this TP and SL is placed based on the 50 points and 100 points. You can also align it to the right, okay, for better viewing. But the problem was in this case, what happened, this trading panel opened and so it added one extra layer, okay. So it could be convenient for a few guys who want to double check their prices, but for a few people, it could not be convenient, okay. So what we can do is, let me just cancel this order and we can simply switch on this quick trade mode okay and now if i go uh, go and go put the buy limit okay so now here you will see that the trading window is not appearing and your order is going with tp and sl okay you can also place direct market orders with tp and sl from this option as i have explained earlier now whatever uh, trades you have done you can see those trades under this account section okay so these are your trades orders and trades then you can also view your position pnl you can check your balance and the holdings if you have any although it does not apply in this case okay uh, and then from here you can change your account type okay so here we have this uh, rhythmic option and other option as well and you can change your server over here okay so I hope you understood how we can connect Rhythmic with co-charting and do one-click trading. Thank you, guys.